Hello again, Brick Stackers. This is Chris with another Lego haul, and this is a Lego haul 20. So I've had a good, big number there. A lot of money spent. Sometimes I think it's too much money spent, but anyway, love this hobby, love this passion, and really glad I got into doing some of these Lego hauls here on YouTube to share because I love watching somebody else get their stuff. You know, I think a big part of attracting these Lego hauls is what everybody else is getting and what we can look forward to getting and sometimes you know we're all in different financial situations and sometimes i look at these people buying these 200 dollars sets and i dream of being able to buy a couple of those and doing a lego haul but one day my stuff's all clearance now and one day i'll be able to get the big boy toys so anyway until then i wanted to show some more clearance items again if, I, if you haven't caught on in some earlier lego hauls i live in a very rural area and my one walmart in my town I got another Walmart 30 miles from here and another Walmart about 22 miles from here. So I've got three Walmarts, but they're all spread out almost 30 miles apart. Uh, and people don't buy Lego as much in this rural area as compared to some of the larger cities. And that can be a good thing, it can be a bad thing. Don't I don't have as wide a variety as some of you do. I don't have the targets that have the awesome clearance, I have to drive an hour to get to a target. Uh, but when Walmart puts their stuff on clearance, it might sit there for months. I mean, I have found Lego sets from 2011 still sitting on the shelves. So, you know, stuff that's way past retired and gone still sitting there and some of them still marked down pretty well. Some of them are still full price. But anyway, so I want to show you this. I know a lot of this stuff's gone from some of your Walmarts. Uh, let me get these out of the bags real quick. These two out of this first bag. Let's see here. All right. And a previous Lego haul, I showed you this. I was at, this is a different store I went to that had one of these tanker trucks left on clearance. 11 or 13 bucks, cannot remember. But anyway, I got it, it wasn't full retail. Got uh, one of these at 60016, the tanker truck from Lego City. So I got that one, we'll set it back over here. I also got two of the Star Wars 94-96. This is the Desert's Gift. Good selection of minifigs in there. You got three, four minifigs. Uh, Luke Skywalker, Boba Fett, uh, Kithaba, and Lando Calrissian. I know I've slaughtered a couple of those names, but anyway. Uh, this set is, you know, you can get a pretty good bit for the minifigs in it, or you could at least uh, not too long ago. I uh, prefer they went on clearance, but still a good set. Uh, just to show you the difference sold out at two of the three Walmarts I visit and the third Walmart has never marked it down has a full shelf full of them and I'm waiting for them to go on clearance too and I'll get a few more of those so that's those two and found one of these last one on the shelf and it was another one of the six uh, eight six three Batman Batwing battle over Gotham City Got Joker, a henchman, and the Batman minifig in it on sale for $25. And it was the only one left on the shelf, and I went ahead and purchased it at this Walmart. And then I cleaned out some of the smaller battle packs at the other Walmart that I went to, and they have zero left on the shelf of these. And that was $94.89. That's the Indoor Rebel Trooper battle packs. So, got three of those and another one of the 6865 Captain Americas. The previous video I showed you this one uh, and it's the same situation at the other Walmart I went to. Walking down through the toy aisle just out of blue this was the only one on the shelf stuck on the shelf was I think it was actually on the Duplo section sitting on the shelf. No price tag, no nothing, just sitting there. So apparently it popped up somewhere in the store after somebody hit it or set it down when mama wouldn't buy it for them and Lucky me, I found it. Again, like I said in the earlier video, this set right here, it's a cheap set for about 12 bucks, some change, and I believe it will continue to grow over the next year. So, that's it for this Lego haul. This is Lego haul 20. Uh, look forward to, as my microphone pops off and hits the floor, I uh, look forward to doing many more here in the future and get up there and catch up with Brick Czar. He's almost to his Lego haul 100. And I know I'm away, you know, way off for that. And if you haven't checked his channel out, go ahead and check his channel out and also Bricks on the Dollar. 
two of the guys I subscribe to and really like. Uh, and then I've also had somebody ask for a shout out. I usually don't do this, but since he does comment a lot of my videos, uh, Brick Villa Studios, Brick Villa Studios, uh, he gets a shout out on this video. And uh, until next time, I ask y'all uh, to continue subscribing, commenting, liking, and sharing our videos. It does mean a lot, and I appreciate it. Uh, and follow us on Twitter at Brickstackers. Check out my Bricklink store uh, if you're in the need for some minifigs or some parts. And until next time, y'all continue to stack those bricks and have fun. See ya.